Hi. This is 614 and Signing Naturally lecture on page 346. Uh, true fish story. I'll just go through um, some of the vocabulary here and transition signs as well as we're going to talk about signs for negating. Um, the first sign on page 347, we've learned that before. Sign for camping. Your, hand, your hands like this and camping. Camping. Easier said than done, right? Um, enthusiastic, excited with anticipation. Didn't we just do this? Urgh. I think we did. Nevertheless, excited, your index, excuse me, your feeling finger, your middle finger, alternated touching the chest and coming up. So excited. Looks like that from the side. To put on one's clothes, remember the sign for clothes, your five hands with your thumbs touching your chest, alternated for putting on your clothes, so putting on your clothes like that. Fish, dom non-dominant hand, your passive hand like this, and then fish, and commonly done moving forward, so fish. To move or act with haste, rush, to hurry, your H hands like this with the accompanying grammatical features. So going out away from you, wavy H's. Hurry. To be counted, all inclusive. So your hands like this, you're open five, and then coming into your non-dominant cup hand. To be glad, please, content, happy. Learn this before happy. Your open thought or your open B. Happy. To be angry. Your cupped five hand comes in front of your face with the company. Angry, mad. Uh, going to the next page on 348, talking about transition signs. It's just demarcation of time, sequencing of events. Last night, last, last night, last night, early in the morning, 4 a.m. So here we've got in the morning, the morning, touching where your watch would be, and then doing four. Now he's added a.m. in there. I don't think that necessarily, if you're already saying it's in the morning, so morning at four. Um, not necessarily did with 4 a.m., but if you want to do morning, 4 a.m., go for it. Other transitions upon arriving at the campground. So, arriving at the campground. Notice eyebrows up, transition. Uh, going over to page 349, signs for negating. Trust me, these are not all the signs for negating, but these are four of them. Um... And these are ones that have come into play in this story, which is a true fish story. It's not a true fish. Is it really true? Anyway. Not able to do something because something is preventing you. Can't. Remember, we've learned this. Your passive, non-dominant index finger and your dominant coming down like that. Can't. Can't. Some deaf people make a joke and say this is a sign for can can this is really a sign for can but can but that's just a joke can't uh to politely tell someone you're not going to do something caution against us that's a gesture more more or less a gesture i wouldn't necessarily call that a sign to say something is not to deny remember sign for not your modified a comes under um underneath from your chin and flicks out so not not no person, thing, or none. None. We just did that. And I think that's going to get you through 614. So do the exercises and everything, and you'll be doing great. Contact me if you have any questions.